What is going on everybody? Erock here bringing you guys a brand new video. Hope you guys are all having a great day today. Today's video, we are doing a microphone review of the EM USB condenser microphone. Now, for the sake of this video, I do have to say they did send me this for a review. So special shout out to the people over at Mackie. Um, I haven't really heard of this brand or these guys too too much before getting my hands on this um, but anyway if you guys do enjoy this review at all leave a like consider subscribing to the channel if you have any questions after the video be sure to leave them down below for this USB microphone and uh, so let's get started to see what comes in the box and everything so the the box itself and everything it's no complaints obviously it's just like a box and whatnot um, so we will prop this open so at the time of this video it'll set you back around a hundred dollars on their website or according to their website so I know these two pieces are for the software I'm gonna put them aside because it has my code for it comes with software itself to do additional features to the microphone and everything so you obviously just get <clears throat> a little pamphlet here is the microphone itself take this out it's got some weight to it as far as the build quality I would say this is very very good for the build quality um, the metal in here it doesn't really push in too far like or at all I would say so the quality itself is is very good it has a mute button it has dials for onboard headphone monitoring so the independent volume controls is like a convenient way to monitor that and then on the bottom side, it does have your USB and your headphone monitoring as well. But yeah, the it has a decent amount of weight to it. And overall, it has a really good feel to it. I'm not going to lie. It has a cardioid polar pattern, as you can see with that little uh, kind of like a half butt or whatever, whatever you simply want to call that a heart, which means that um, when you're speaking into the microphone, you have to speak directly into this side. Don't speak into the, the sides around it or anything. But yeah, overall, this is a very, very good quality microphone and you're not hearing it yet. I will compare it to a couple other microphones that I do have. The one that I'm currently using, which is like a $50 one off of Amazon. Um, and then there's nothing too much else in the box here besides in this so as in here it's probably you're gonna get your your cables and everything okay so you get a tripod stand as well build quality on this as well it's not like plastic like a lot of them are the legs might be a little plasticky but it's uh it's all right i'm not going to use it for the desktop desktop stand as well um but it is super convenient that if you don't have a boom arm or anything that they come with this and the quality on this is it's honestly not too bad at all either. So shout outs to, to Mackie for including a, a uh, tripod and everything. Then of course you're just going to get your cables or anything else in here. And then the uh, and then uh, you're going to get the mic clip and everything. It's kind of hard to see on camera, but um, yeah, quality and everything seems pretty good so far. Let's get everything plugged in and we'll see what it all sounds like with default. No sort of uh, enhancements or plugins to it. So now real quickly before I did want to move on to that, I also wanted to show you guys the dials themselves. I know I didn't really give a good sort of uh, visual of them. The mute button, it has a little bit of a push to it and uh, the dials themselves. There is very, very little wiggle when it comes to if you're worried about the dials being like not good quality and everything. So just keep that in mind. The dials, they do move a little bit, but it's not too, it's not like nothing make or break here. But uh, yeah, so overall, this is how the microphone's gonna look and everything, so. All right, now we have the Mackie USB condenser microphone plugged into the computer. Literally just plug and play. You don't have to download anything. If you want to, they do include software. Um, I could either quickly briefly go over that in this video or if you want a video of me going through all of the uh, accessories and filters and stuff that you can use with their programs there 
to enhance this microphone even more. So like I said, this is just plug and play at the moment. There's no filters, there's no noise gate, there's no condenser, there's no equal, there's none of that stuff. This is just how it sounds coming out of the box. Um, my other mic that I was using, this is like a 50 to $60 microphone off of Amazon. And I have probably like seven or eight different filters on it to make this thing sound decent. So I will, in the end, put any sort of filters on this one to make it sound as best as possible, in my opinion. But this is how it sounds just coming out of the box. And I listened to it previously beforehand, and it doesn't sound bad at all. Um, I think you're getting your money's worth and everything. Uh, if you want me to do, I'm going to click on the mute button to see what kind of uh, sort of response you get from clicking on that. So. And uh, so for the sake of this video and recording, um, I have the gain knob set to about 75% or where 3 o'clock would be. And on my PC, I have the output level to 50%. So just to keep that in mind, if you do get this microphone, that is the sweet spot that I'm using. That gives this quality, um, no sort of interference or anything. And uh, so now the cardioid polar pattern itself. Uh, so that means you should be talking directly into the microphone where it's showing the dials and everything. So now if I do start to rotate the item and go around the device and talk normally and everything, you should be hearing a difference in mic quality and everything. So you shouldn't be talking into the back of the microphone. And also you shouldn't be talking into the top of the microphone because that's not exactly what it's used for. It's a conduct cardioid polar pattern to where you should be talking into the front side with the dials mute button and it shows you the cardioid polar pattern where you should be talking to as well all right so let's take this video for gamers out there i am slapping my fingers across the keys of my logitech g pro uh keyboard it's not the super clickiest keyboard out there but this is just how it sounds with some background noise of the keyboard. Keep in mind, this microphone is not on a microphone stand like a boom arm. It's on the stand it gives you, so it's not gonna give you the best uh, help when it comes to that sort of stuff, but if you get it on an arm and everything and then throw some uh, filters on it, it should sound a little bit better and take away some of this volume of the keys. Now, shout out to Banter, my band, Podcastage. Uh, we're gonna use his uh, plosives test please bring pizza pronto please bring pizza pronto please bring pizza pronto and all right i did say i was gonna compare it to uh three microphones uh i actually only have this one i gave the other two away the people that needed microphones so i was gonna okay yeah so this what you're hearing is the usb condenser microphone Again, no filters, no nothing added to this. And now I will switch over to this microphone and I took off all the filters and everything as well. So now this is what this microphone sounds like without any filters, no uh, noise gate, no equalizer, no conden no nothing. So just to give you a little description, a little feel of what these different types of microphones sound like. Again, this is like 50 or $60 off Amazon. This one at the current price of their website on Mackie, it is $99.99. And one more time, heading back to the microphone of the review of this video. So just to give you guys a little bit of a, a sound difference in what it could sound like. All right, everybody. So now I have applied all the filters that I've been using with OBS um, onto this microphone to just basically give it a little bit of an oomph to basically maximize what this kind of thing can do in sort of like a podcast voiceover type setting. This microphone is very, very good as well when it comes to musicians. I know there have been a few people that like record songs and stuff with this microphone. What I've seen, what I've been told, what I've looked up, this isn't a bad microphone if you're if you want to do vocals and stuff too. Um, obviously, there's better ones out there, but if you're on sort of like a budget, I'm not really sure how much those kind of microphones are supposed to go for. But for a hundred dollars, uh, with just this quality, I think it sounds pretty dang good. Um, with mine included, it came with the waveform uh, software 
it's for like music musicians and stuff it'll help you doing like voiceover stuff and my podcast stuff in addition to the pro tools avid uh sort of software download i know my camera doesn't like to focus in on that stuff very well but if i switch over to my monitor screen this is waveform oem i'm not gonna pretend like i know what all this is okay but I know if you do like new projects and everything, you open this stuff up. It's for like certain recordings. If you're doing singer songwriter, podcast stuff, EDM stuff, band recordings, all that stuff is on here. A bunch, a bunch, a bunch of plugins came with this. Let me see if I can figure that out. So yeah, all these plugins as well come with it. Again, I'm not going to pretend like I know what all of this stuff means, but you get waveform uh, software that's super, super dope as well as you get the pro tools first again if you create a new um sort of project tool here again they give you all these options here if you're a songwriter what kind of music you're trying to do um so if you do like i don't know hip-hop or something you hit create uh we're gonna i had one open previously just to kind of look around in here and then this will load uh yes i know some of my stuff isn't plugged in but and then here you go like look at all this stuff you guys f that would know a lot more about this than me you get like mixers and everything if you're looking for stuff for like music and everything and to help you this software included with the microphone it's gonna help you guys so much as well but um overall i feel like this microphone is like a no-brainer to get if you're looking for something usb it's relatively cheap on the cheaper side with good audio quality and it comes with all these features i know there's like the elgato wave and stuff out there with all of their mixers and features with it but that's like 50 to 100 dollars more than this one i think if i'm not mistaken like the wave 3 is a lot more and some of those are like hard to get i'm telling you guys i'm leaving the link to the description down below to this this company this they have mixers they have audio stuff headphones uh, everything if you're a musician singer songwriter podcaster just doing voiceovers playing games i honestly think overall this is a decent to very very good microphone you guys could use and i cannot thank the wonderful people over at mackie enough for sending me this to do sort of a review to trusting me and, and to trying to showcase what this microphone can do at a very basic level uh, I never said I was any sort of like a professional when it comes to this stuff, but um, I feel like that's the best I could do in to showcase what this microphone can do. Uh, if there's anyone out there that has any questions, feel free to leave them down below. And if there's any other, uh, if there's any other like companies out there that want to, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but uh, that's going to be it for the video. Like, comment, and subscribe. Again, if you have questions, um, but that's gonna be it for me i appreciate any and all support guys go and get this microphone it's super super good and as always i will see you guys in the next one